few more examples on basic subtraction. Let's now see what 6 minus 2 equals. Okay, so let's say you went to the ice cream store. You love ice creams, I know I do. And you decided you were going to buy 6 all for yourself. You must have been really hungry. So let us draw 6 ice cream cones here. There's 1, one two, 2, 3, three 4, four five, 5, 6. 6 green ice cream cones. So then your friend came along and decided to help you because, you know, it was hot outside and they were melting, so he ate two. One, two. Okay? So your friend ate two of them. So how many do we have left? Okay, there's six minus two, so we initially had six in total, and we crossed out two. So let's count what we have left. There's one. Two, three, and four. Okay, so the difference is six here minus two that your friend ate leaves us with only four left. So your answer here is four. Six minus two equals four. That was a lot of ice cream cones still. Four ice cream cones. Hope your stomach feels good. Now let me show you a different example. I have a seven inch long rope. Okay, I'm gonna write that here, seven, okay? Seven inches long rope, and I cut off three. That means I take three away from it. So here's the minus sign to symbolize I take it away. Okay, and I'll write three. What do I have left? Equals, okay? So how many inches of rope am I left with? So let me draw a rope here and score it to seven. So of this rope, now imagine if three inches were cut off, okay? So let's score that out. One, two, three. So let's count here, what do we have left, okay? There's one, two inches, three inches, and four inches. So I'm left with only four inches of thread. So seven minus three is four. Let me give you one last example. What is, let me write that down here, what is six minus zero? If you're listening really carefully before, I'm sure you're gonna get this one. Very easy. If you remember, I had explained zero in the addition module. Right? So what is zero? It stands for nothing. It does not have a value, remember? So when you take away zero from six, okay, remember the cupcakes? Okay, you're taking away nothing. Therefore, six minus zero, that means six, you're taking away nothing from six, is what? You're right, six. Okay, so any number minus zero is the same number however big or small it may be. Always keep this in mind when it comes to subtraction. I hope you had fun. You had a lot of ice creams today. I hope you didn't get a stomachache. Well, see you next time. Bye-bye.